There was an episode of Seinfeld a while back. Actually, it was probably about 10 years ago. But Jerry's in his car, and he's scratching his nose on one side of his face. And one of the girls he likes is in the lane next to him, pulls up next to him, and looks over, and it looks like Jerry's picking his nose. She gets disgusted and drives off. And he's sitting there saying, it was a pick, it wasn't a scratch. I, I, I can't do a Seinfeld impression. But basically, the way she was viewing him, it looked different than it really was. So with that concept, I'm going to show you some views and how views work in SharePoint. Um, basically, a view lets you filter and change the way a list appears without editing or removing or changing any of the information in it. So lists, lists and libraries allow you to use views. And what you can see here is I have an all items view, which shows everything. And I went ahead and created a view called cheap stuff. So anything with a price under $5 will be displayed. So if I click that, you can see my milk is $3.50, my eggs are $4.25, my bread's $2.75. So maybe I'm, I'm a little low on, on money and I just want to get the cheap stuff. So that would be, I would use this view for my shopping list. Um, maybe I'm trying to be frugal and I want to only buy things that have that I have a coupon for. So if I choose to have a coupon view, I'll be able to see, oh, here's milk. That's, oh, I've got a coupon for all three of these. Um, the dog food's really expensive, but I got a coupon. So, okay. So what a list does is, is let, or I'm sorry, what a view does is let you filter list items and library, uh, documents in libraries based on criteria that you set. So I can go in and edit this view, or I can edit, I, you select a view you want and then edit it here. I'll, and again, I'll, a later lesson will show you how to create and modify those views. But I just wanted to show you the concept of a view. Sometimes those articles, you know, I try to be as descriptive and verbose as I can, um, but sometimes it just helps to see it. So this is what views are and what they let you do in SharePoint. All right, so be sure to check out the next lesson, and we'll see you later.